Hello folks, welcome back to the channel, Farm Rival Extreme here. Here we are back on the Lanka for Adventure Survival. And yes, I know it's been, what, two weeks since last episode? And yeah, just lost track of things and that. And yeah, so I got four behind with this place. But anyway, so we're in August still. Last episode, we merged all the fields together. Well, I say all the fields together, we created what well, think two big fields so all these fields here are merged together unfortunately I can't do anything about the texture here on the ground that is fixed and cannot be removed and yeah I did set the border for our next mega field so once the soybeans I think it is ready to harvest yeah soybeans and canola I think these are not that far behind so if we have a little look so yeah, they are going to be ready soon. Soybeans, I think, going to be ready tomorrow, if not in October. I'll turn you off. Not you. But yeah, so we need to get our planter. Because yeah, we're going to be doing corn. I think the plan was to do maize with this. Yeah, maize silage with the fermented silage we placed in last episode. Along with the infinite flower glitch, obviously I have turned off the barley section because that is a glitch I've been having. So, once this get a better model, so well at least a replacement model, so that we don't have any issues. And you know, unfortunately, the thing with this is it's the gear, and I think it's more of these. Was it Panther Stiger and that? Case the pan for a second we're using. There we go. I see, once we get cracking along, it's ain't too bad. But until we get to the right gears and that. Oh, missing bits. Let's get back over. But yeah, we'll draw this with corn. Also doing the fertilizer at the same time. And if we have a look. Again, just a bit of a refresher, so fertilizer state. So yeah, technically we are putting that second application of fertilizer down. Obviously some parts aren't gonna have that, so afterwards what I'll do is I'll get the fertilizer spreader and just go over everything. Even though probably then it'll be worth it that. But yeah, once this corn is done, this is gonna be huge like uh, potential for chaff that obviously with our fermented silo because yes we can do chaff and grass obviously when we are using the forge harvester for this that's going to be things well we need the money for it because as remembered we're all this series we can not lease so that's going to be problematic mods and that we can use so got the forge harvesters all of these are too modern I'm really sticking with the 80s we're in at the moment, 88. Yeah, looks like we're going to be stuck with this 3 meters working with. I know there's like the Class Jaguar one, the small version, but I think that's more, ah, uh, what's that? I'll say that's more in the 90s and that, and yeah, we're going to be going with this Let's Play series and that in the future, actually within like the next to be honest, a couple of episodes I think. I'm just going over these weeds here and that. But yeah, these cannot be removed. I thought I'd do something about that, but I guess not. So But yeah, anyways we'll crack on this. And yeah, with the plan going forward is with progressing with the series as a whole, I am gonna be picking the new map for us going into the 1990s. I'll have some fun saved up. And then from there, we can, you know, just move along in that to move to a new area. Because, yeah, I'm not saying we have conquered the long cup, but spawns are at the point now where every harvest we are just rapidly expanding to the point. We've got two mega fields. And I guarantee after we've done signage, we are able to purchase 89 and 90. But yeah, I still want to dab with some animals now, like some silage in that. For cows now. You know, breed cows for a year now, sell them. So yeah, if I get the cows at 12 months old, 
let them grow up. And yeah, come 24 months. Obviously they reproduced, so we can sell the baby calves for a veal. Or to another farm to raise them. And then, yeah, the money we get. Save it up and yeah, move to a new area. Not sure where I'm going to be moving to yet. I'm thinking somewhere in Germany. Well, to be honest, I know I've been doing a lot of UK maps as of late. We've just finished about a week or so ago, Court Farm. But yeah, with my two new Let's Play series, going to be releasing tomorrow on Wednesday. Or well, my new Let's Play release tomorrow, because I'm recording this after doing mods for Monday, so on Tuesday. Actually, what? It's 5 o'clock now, or 20 past 5 here in the UK, so. Get this done today, I'll release it late today. I knew this space series can drop tomorrow on Fair and Country site. But yeah, that's gonna be a fun little fun let's play series. But yeah, I've got plans for these, so yeah. Anywho, enough waffling on. Let's get this I'm not plowing, planting done. And I'll see you folks afterwards once we start to roll in. go it is half past three and yeah we're almost done with all the rolling all the planting is done so we've done this section of the mega field over here now just need to roll this section over here however what I'm going to do is try to complete one contract today so yeah because again I can't remember whether or not we've done our three Required con well free not required but free maximum amount of contracts we can do in a month. So what I'm gonna just do is I'm gonna set a worker off again. Been using the workers, mine's gone down that's because I have bought this over, so yep, purchase the Bart Snow V3 score for your bell wrapper. So we'll get this contract done for silage. So yeah, this requires a mowing of course, so what we're going to do is take this and grab our mowers, spend money on getting this repaired and whilst we're here we'll get this filled up with fuel. We will start mowing the field and as I always do, I will I'm try to be a bit clever with getting as most of the outside grass as we can. Because yeah, horse with sometimes with contract work and depends on the fields and that. Because for example, field 12, you do have that little bit outside the fields you can have so I'll say this grass here on our left to the path is fine for the most part. Yeah, bits are not mowing, so 
I think we're going to be quite limited here, but still, regardless, I'm going to get as much as we can moat, and we'll grab our pickup to use as a wind rover. So, yeah, we need to get this done because rain is forecast for 5 p.m. There is a great demand at the grain mill, but unfortunately, that is for sunflower, of which we don't have. So, thank you. We'll get this finished off. Shouldn't take us too long. Now, we'll see if you actually get yourself in position. And then, once we're wind rowing with the worker, I'm going to go with this, our Philadelphia Tagri, and get his all belled up. So, we're currently doing 157 year round bells. But, of course, as soon as we get sort the end of the field off, I think we get another bell for 125 centimeters, then I will go with that. So, one strip will lead us to one bell, so not too bad. And with all that being done, we got six big bells and yeah, just about one small bell. I will put back to 157 years and get this last bit here done. So when we do bay next, where there's another bay contract or our own bells and that, at least then we have a decent place to start off with. The next one we need to do is just go ahead and wrap these bells. I think I've gone with a little bit of a turquoisey color. And this spurs out for that little bell on end turner, so then when we get the front loader with this later on, we shouldn't have too many issues, hopefully, with getting this all loaded up, but you never know. But seven bells, I don't see us having many issues with this. And alright, so I've taken over the worker, and yeah, we're just finishing off this last strip here. It is 20 past five, and. Yeah, we've done the bell, done the wrapping, that is on and loaded, that is at the forge dealer ready to be sold. However, since August is a bad price for silage at the moment, I'm helping the farmer do the contract for by waiting another month. So yeah, let me finish this off, we're heading to September and yeah, we get the bell sold and then that's where I think we'll leave it for today. But yeah, first of all, we do need to sell this, so... Yep, point 0.1 hours, so yeah, we get some money back, and yeah, I think overall that was worth it. So now let's go and get the bell sold, it has a little bit of a voice crack there. So there we go, it's the next day, we're in September, so let's put the times back down to times three. So yeah, 36 and a half hours in later, so should get a decent amount of money for this, so let's go and sell these. And hopefully these are selling and they're not uh, lovely jobsy because of the trigger and that. So you know what? Screw it. So what I'm gonna do is so head over here. I know what? Screw it. Screw it all. There we go. So yeah, overall we got fifty-five hundred of extra profit. So. Let's go and complete that contract for a grand. So yeah, we've accepted two different contracts, two plan contracts on 15 and 66. Yeah, they shouldn't take us that long to do. Tempted uh, harvesting contract maybe. Might as well do something a little bit different. So not screw it. So let's do feel 30. So Phil 30 is up north, so fair enough. But yeah, now what we need to do is, so if you look at our fields, rolled in, yeah, a little tight patches we missed, but that's the thing, they may look big now, but in this grand scheme of things, they're not that bad. Yeah, we need to plow some of these fields once they are harvested. I guess they're gonna need lime as well probably afterwards weeds I know we had some weeds already so yeah pretty much yeah now I've got so that's lovely as always fertilizing basically it's 53 50 86 and 87 I oh, crap I forgot these fields over here please don't tell me they're ready to be harvested Oh, thank fuck for that. <laughs> yeah, let's get that done. So, yeah. I think what? We'll get that done in the next episode. 
we are done with the windmill as well, so yeah, how many did we get? Another one or two? Oh, yeah, not too bad there, so I think overall we're looking good. Egg pallets, yeah, 2,000 litres of eggs, we'll sell those. And yeah, so let me grab that spray for a sec, wherever I left that too. Ah, there it is, just over here. So, do you have fertilizer or herbicide in? Ah, right, so you've got liquid fertilizer in, so might as well use that. I do have some herbicide out already. And yeah, if I find the trigger for this, somewhere. Oh, there we go. Because, yeah, like, we've got a lot of stuff in storage, so yeah, we've got another thousand litres of liquid fertilizer. Yep, got another 40 year pallet of herbicide, so we'll get that used up. Because, yeah, I want to clear this, and then we realize also had 18 straw bells. That's the thing, do we do cows? Like, got a year and a half left here, or a year and three months, so. Will it be actually worth doing? Honestly, I don't know. To be honest, I actually am really tempted to say, you know what? Let's just sell everything. So yeah, let's get these fields over here done. But yeah, you can tell where we can fields because these sections here where I haven't got any weeds. You know, shrink, you know, because yeah, these are actually planted, so... Actually, why don't we have weeds? Honestly, you know what, I don't know. But yeah, overall yieldage is looking good, so if we look over this field over here... Yep, just weeder and that. But yeah, once we get that fertilizing done, we should be good. So, feeding the wall. There we go, I love to see that texture difference. So, it makes our life so much easier when it comes to working. And to be honest, I am really tempted to set the John Deere on this with the worker and that. And yeah, get these contracts done, so... so yeah, plowing, it's going to be some good cash for that. And even that harvesting contract should be interesting. So, right, I thought before we leave for the episode here, I think, yeah, get this contract quickly done. All our lorry up here now, because I wasn't sure whether or not it's going to have a full load or not. In terms with the combine, of course, not a trailer and that. But yeah, we just about got this done in under one combine's worth though, so... But yeah, I still think it's worth bringing that up here anyway, so... That's emptying in. Like so, it's a bit... Again, it is a bit of a FNAF. Or... F not FNAF, I know it's a Freddy. Bit of a FAF, so... Yeah, that is done. Also, the workers being busy. They are spraying the fields and that, and... What are you doing over there? Fair enough, appreciate you spraying this bit here, but I prefer to spend our very expensive fertilizer on on this field over here, so we get you refilled. So I don't want you making the same mistake again. And I think what we'll do first of all is just spray this section here, so that in the future, well not in the future, when the worker now is going up and down, it doesn't cross over and act, so We'll get you sorted out of the way. And to be honest, I'm thinking we can use more liquid fertilizer, you know, get these cheap barrels and that. But yeah, I think we've got so much soil fertilizer now about, so I want to use that up first of all. Yeah, try to find the texture difference. So yeah, little bits like that where it's been missed, I'm not gonna worry about. I'll worry about it when we're using the solid fertilizer and that. Because, yeah, we can get those on bulk. So, with big bags, we can go with, uh, was it the multi crop greenhouse mods and that we're using for these. So, yeah. 4,000 years for six grand. Very expensive, don't get me wrong. But, yeah, could be worse than that. So, you are on the way. You are empty, so let's take you over to, was it grain sell, grain mill, not grain mill, I don't think it is, no, farmer's market, so 
Yeah, let's see how much we could get from this. So, again, I'm not expecting a lot since there's a contract worth a grand, so there may be a grand or so in profit. So, there we go at the farmer's market. So, grain sell point is just here. So, yeah, tenth of those, but I think they are something that's worth it, especially to even trip the combine and that. So, yeah, I doubt we're going to get much. So yeah, 800 quid in product from the crop, so yeah, I'll forge quick to show that, so next episode we'll get these two finished off. And yeah, then that'll be our free contracts for September. Spraying still underway, so yeah, we'll get this finished off in the next episode. Can we get all these fields sprayed in September? That's going to be the question, that. I think if you use solid fertilizer, then the answer is yes. But who knows? So, anyways, that's where I'm going to leave it today. And as always, hope you enjoyed the episode. If so, smash the button. Feel free to down below. If you want to share us, please be my guest. If you're not, subscribe to get the piece to stir. But, for choose to do, hope you're going to stay. But for now, see me from Evo Extreme. And I'll see you all very soon.